sisters, brothers, siblings in the Episcopal Church in Northern Indiana, grace and peace be with you and Jesus, the light for all people. Well, guess what, friends? This is the end of our third day at the Episcopal Youth event known as EYE 2023. We've just concluded a, a wonderful day. It's my privilege to invite two of our young people to share their reflections, Dominic and, and Abby. Uh, tell us uh, your experiences of this day or something that stood out from the experiences of the last three days. Dominic. Um, I would have to say what they offer here. I love all the activities they offer and you know, my best part is the food. I love the food they offer also. Uh, what, any, any, uh, do, any, sort of workshop that struck your uh, caught your attention that you um, to? I feel like it was finding myself you know learning how to find myself and how to be with God it was one of my favorite workshops there that's great thank you so much Abby how about you um, I really liked how there was a point made about how they like this event is a safe space for people of the LGBTQ community people of different races people of all shapes and sizes and there was a point made that the church is a space this church is a safe space. Thank you. And Abby and I, along with Daniel, had the chance to go to a workshop this afternoon that promised uh, that one of the outcomes that we would we would be walking out of that room as theologians, right? Yeah. And theology means that we come to learn how to talk about God. We we had someone tell us about what the specific or peculiar or wonderful things are about. Anglican anthropology, anthropology, Bible anthro anthropology, eschatology, uh, all those big words. And uh, it was really a compelling way for us to sort of engage what, what it means for us as Episcopalians to be people who are followers of Jesus. Friends, thank you for your support. Thanks for your prayer. And we look forward to seeing you later. Grace and peace be with you. Bye-bye.